Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny dupes spy into revealing how he was poisoned. Here's a summary of the article. His phone number was disguised as that of the headquarters of the FSB, according to Navalny's team and a recording of the call later provided to CNN and Bellingcat. After Kadratsev confirmed his identity, Navalny said he'd been tasked with getting a brief understanding from the team members. What went wrong? Why was there a complete failure in Tomsk with Navalny? Kadratsev's responses in the 45-minute call provide the first direct evidence of the unit's involvement in poisoning Navalny. The FSB on Monday issued a statement claiming that a video of Navalny's conversation with Kadratsev, posted by the opposition leader on his YouTube channel, was a fake, facilitated by foreign intelligence. The so-called investigation about actions allegedly taken against him, which was published online by Alexei Navalny as a planned provocation aimed at discrediting the FSB of Russia and employees of the Federal Security Service, which would not have been possible without the organizational and technical support of foreign special services, the statement reads, according to state news agency TASS. The FSB has launched a check of Navalny's investigation and will give a procedural assessment following its results, the statement said. Most dramatically Kadratsev provided a detailed account of how the nerve agent was applied to a pair of Navalny's underpants. In an almost surreal moment on the call, Navalny commiserated with Kadratsev that he had survived. This post received a score of 83,000, with an upvote ratio of 92%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Holy shit. I can only imagine what Navalny felt during that call. And how he managed to keep his composure is beyond me. Could this be another assassination attempt? This time trying to make him die from laughter. Greater than and how he managed to keep his composure is beyond me. Video of the call with Eng subs here. Full audio in Russian. Full audio with English subs. FYI, they are gonna put English subtitles at some point they do it with every investigation edit, English subtitles are available. Here is a transcript. So the guy they spoke to is fucking dead now right? If not yet he will be soon yes. He's scheduled to fall out of a window. I didn't know he was also a COVID doctor. That would make five doctors who fell out of windows, the latest of whom was in his underwear and had a stab wound. Why are they targeting people that are working to stop the virus? I don't get it. He should call Putin next. Vladimir. This is your mother. Why did you poison Alexander? How do I know you are who you say you are? I am me. Okay, I'm listening. It's amazing how many people never ask that question though. I work with kids in the mental health field. Often I have to speak with providers to get background information. We always get consent but rarely need it, as doctors will give you all the information you want as soon as you say you are a caseworker. I remember a video from a guy who did penetration testing. Like he was paid to try to get inside buildings and hack computers without authorization in order to test if the security of the company was alright. And the dude just fucking literally waltzed behind the counters and starting plugging stuff in laptops and nobody batted an eye. Like one time he had to enter inside a locked building. So he just waited outside pretending to be on the phone until someone opened the door to leave and he just walked in while the door was open like it was the most normal thing to do, because, you know, it is. I used to do this testing at my last job. I tried tailgated into locked areas probably 10 times over to years and was never stopped. A white man with a clipboard can be a dangerous weapon. When my dad worked at a power plant, the guy testing a security gate got his tires shot out by an overzealous guard on his first day. That guard became a hero and meme back in the 90s. That's insane. Good thing he had good aim. Who's to say he wasn't aiming for the guy's head? This is worth a read. Navalny Shaw has huge brass balls. Seriously? Is this a movie or something? Is he just Liam Neeson with a Russian accent? This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.